Hi there. My name is Nick Dutch, and I'm a man who does a job, a very special job. And this job is simply called tarot reading. Now, there's an awful lot of hokum which is spoken about tarot reading. The whole subject is laden with superstition, fear, dread, paranoia, attacks from skeptics from a wide variety of different angles. But today, I just want to tell you in a more objective manner about what a tarot reading really is. You see, when a client comes to the tarot reader, they ask a question. The tarot reader themselves engages with the customer and has a conversation with the customer. But this is a conversation which is assisted, shall we say, by the apparently random symbols which turn up within the tarot reading. That's all, nothing more and nothing less. The tarot is nothing more or less than a pack of playing cards. That's all. But the history over the past few hundred years, that's all, historically not a long period of time at all, has filled each and every single card with meaning, moral stories, references to the way that human beings feel in different stages of their life or under different circumstances or situations. When these signs and symbols appear in a tarot spread, they give the inquirer an extra point of view or an extra perspective upon the way that their life is going and what could possibly be achieved. It gives them a, a moment of understanding as to precisely what's happening in any particular situation that they wish to ask about. The purpose of a reading, in reality, is to give you, as an inquirer, the opportunity to contemplate other possibilities. No, I'm not here to turn around to you and tell you what you had for dinner last Thursday. Nor am I here to tell you which horse is going to win the next horse race at 3.15 at Kempton Park. However, what I can do is to assist you in understanding some of the issues you may be going through in your life. The most common questions which are asked of a tarot reader relate to relationships, career, money, where the person's life is heading, whether they're on the right track, whether their career is the right one for them, and how they should deal in some of the more complex social situations which appear within the workplace. These are all very down-to-earth, common questions. And they deal with down-to-earth, common issues. So why, you may ask yourself, would a tarot reader of all people be of any use? Simply, a tarot reader is someone who is not in your immediate circle of friends, is not a member of your family, is not an employer or an employee or someone you engage with in your day-to-day -day life. The tarot reader is morally bound by secrecy of sorts. And as such, a tarot reader is someone you can tell things to that you can't tell anybody else. And as many tarot readings, like the ones which I do, are performed over the internet and over the telephone, all right. You don't even need to leave your own house in order to have your consultation. It acts like a form of counseling therapy, but some people say that there's more to it than that. However, whether that's the case or not, I would have to leave that up to you to decide. My personal feeling is that a tarot reading is a practical service. It's something which can essentially do you some good, give you that extra moment of Faith, that extra moment of reflection, an opportunity to have a conversation with someone who is removed from a situation is something which can be very valuable, especially when you're going through some of the more trying issues in your day-to-day -day life. My name is Nick Dutch, and for those of you who are viewing this video on YouTube, check the sidebar for my links so that you can find out how to contact me if you need to. In the meantime, for the moment, I'll say, this is Nick Dutch signing out for now. Good fortune, God and all goddess, and all none of the above bless.